don't I know you, sir? Don't believe so. I haven't been here in many years. Name's Silas Greaves. Silas Greaves? The bounty hunter? Used to be. Ah, well, what are you doing here in Abilene? Just passing through. Got a little business to take care of. Well, sir, it would be an honor if you would allow me to buy you a beer. Hell, son, it would be my honor to drink it. I'm Molly. Howdy. I'm Dwight. That's Jack and Steve. Ben's behind the bar. Oh, I bet you got some great stories. A couple. <laughs> Any of them true. Jack, be nice. A few. What about your shootout with Henry Plummer's gang in Bannock, Montana? Is that where you started as a bounty hunter? That's what it says in this here dime novel. Don't believe everything you read in them dime novels, boy. First man I hunted was back when I was riding with Billy the Kid. You knew Billy the Kid? Damn right. That scrawny son of a bitch had no fear. Wouldn't back down for nobody. I heard he collected the tin stars off any crooked lawman who crossed him. It was a war, boy. The Lincoln County War. And Billy promised his regulators would take the life of every bastard who helped bushwhack John Tunstall. Kid had a big chip on his shoulder and a hair trigger temper. Made him dangerous as hell. It was about 30 years ago. Billy was hiding out in an abandoned farm near Stinkin' Springs. You want to experience for collecting nuggets of truth, huh? Okay. I threw in with the kid because the man I had sworn vengeance on was riding with Billy's enemies. But before I tell you why I want that some bitch dead, let me tell you what happened that day. I was heading back to the hideout when suddenly I had this funny feeling. Funny, haha? -ha. No, Steve. The other kind of funny. Why's that bird flying so slow? Hello? Anybody seen Billy? Oh, yay, hi. 21 notches on his gun. Going. Yeah, maybe I was wrong, but it really sounded like him. It does. I still want to listen to those, um, ah, audio. You have one skill point. Oh, okay. Trapper, Ranger. Oh, I am a dual wield and desperado, that's for true. Are you sure? Yeah, I want to buy that skill. Longer combos, deep pockets, pro armor capacity increase. Yeah. Alright. Return to the hideout. Um, those audiobooks that Roger did with Westerns. I want to listen to them. Oh no, no, she told me we'd go on by. Bad news. I know there's a what? Okay, that's a jump. Can I not run yet? You heard that. We need to stay here to keep an eye on the road. That's not fair. We're missing all the fun. I knew those two morons would never let me through. I had no choice. Oh. Shoot that awesome bitch. Okay, all right. As soon as I stop aiming. Okay, apparently I just can't freaking shoot on my right. You Uh, you learn experience by killing enemies. Makes sense. Was it Pat Garrett's posse? Oh yeah. I heard the shots and I knew I had to move fast. Rescue Billy. Garrett and his army of deputies had surrounded the entire homestead. I decided to help Billy and the boys out of it. So that's just what I did.
Was that supposed to do something more? How do I crouch? Okay, that's how I may look. Ow! Crouch! Crouch? Ah, that's crouch. Okay. Running, running, running. Oh, oh there's a dude there. As the governor of New Mexico was paying for the kid's apprehension, Garrett was able to hire every gun hand in Lincoln County. Dude, I'm behind a rock. That means you can't shoot me. Bruh. Bruh. Got him. Uh. Uh, the hell with these pumpkins. Yeah, smash them pumpkins. Today's gonna be the greatest day of my life. Is there anything in here? Death and pumpkins. Garrett's men were running around like a bunch of chickens with their heads cut off. No good, Pat Garrett. Ooh. Shooting Billy in the dark. Allegedly. Uh, I don't have it for you. I don't want to do it. That chicken was eating that dead man. You can avoid lethal shots. Not a bad idea. Okay. It would be a turkey shoot from up there. Dude, I'm the chosen one. Oh, that was in the face. Headshot. Well, right Luckily, here. these shooters Garrett hired weren't the sharpest tools in the shed. Oh, neither am I. I ain't doing so hot. Personally, I prefer to be on top. Oh, you do, do you? Madam. Indeed, darling. <laughs> but where was I? Oh, yeah. She knows what she's doing. The working girl. Saddle tramps or sod busters or drunken drifters looking to make a few bucks. What kind of people? Oh, I exploded him like a melon. Oh, those look explosive. <laughs> Red barrels. Where am I going? Going that way. Is anybody over here? Always check your surroundings. Then, I heard a friendly voice yelling at me from the window. Back door! We'll cover you! Stop aiming, you idiot! Truth be told, things weren't much better behind the house. Watch your flank! 
<laughs> I cut their numbers in half, but that just made the ones that were left twice the man. I don't fully get the point of that dead eye. I know it slows us. Oh. They made up for their lack of skill with a seemingly endless supply of ammo. Who's shooting me in the face? All right, it was a Billy. bit of a slog, but I finally fought my way around the back of the house. Billy? And like that, you I was inside. None the worse for wear. I don't know if anybody knows the story of Billy the Kid, but uh, <laughs> it doesn't go very well for people being trapped in houses. I passed with Dirty Dave. Hi, Dave. And upstairs, I found Billy and Charlie Baldry. Well, hold on. What's in here? Anything? Don't just get me in room with nothing good in it. Oh, Billy! Billy, 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 Billy. That's a cool screenshot. I should have used it for the thumbnail. Billy looked at me and said, About time, amigo. Grab a gun and get to the window. Hell Boy, yeah. So you were friends with Billy the Kid? Yeah, sort of. Anyway, we were surrounded by dozens of deputized shooters who wanted to do us harm. Best side was steak, chunky chips. What are chunky chips? Like ruffles? Chunky chips. Or are they are you talking chips like fries? New level. Hold on. Uh reload while sprinting. Yes. Yes, sir. Telling you Garrett's men were dropping like flies, but they just kept on coming. I forgot you call them fries. <laughs> even even with French fries, like chunky still confuses me. Steak, steak fries? So the, the the thick fries. I am actually not a fan of steak fries. I like them better That's when Charlie got with in. steak. They're catching us in a crossfire, shouted Billy. <laughs> Get to the other side. Okay. Because you can mop up the steak sauce and the steak juices. But I'll always be a steak and potato man. That do good? Oh no, that looks like Javier. I'm sorry, Javier. was the better part of valor. What's that mean? It means that it was time to cut and run. They got a gatlin, Billy shouted. Get the horses and bring them around back. I'll draw their attention. Where, where am I going? Excuse me. 
I said that it was time to cut and run. Oh, buddy, I'm trying to get ammo. He directed that order at me. And I thought, why the hell do I have to do it? But I went anyway. <laughs> Dumbass that I was back then. Press RB to breach the door. Okay, yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. That false sense of invincibility that many young men have. Ugh. Like Jack here. What Ugh. are you saying, old man? Jack is just joshing with you. Yeah, he better be. Mr. Graves, please continue. Please call me Silas, ma'am. Now, oh. where was I? Getting shot like an asshole. Oh. You won't need a what the hell? Sometimes I'm good. You are heading for the barn. That's a climber. Gonna scalp your ass. Oh. 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 Okay. Making my way Oh. Oh. Dude, that was way better. Yeehaw. Oh, you can hit me through the thing? Now, technically, people didn't really do a wheel back then. They just had an offense to use while the other one ran out of ammo. But, I mean... Who am I to get away with a good time? Sounds like Garrett hired a whole regiment of hired guns. Well, Parrot Garrett's a bitch. Yeah. And just when I thought I was done with them, more of these hapless bastards would pop up. Oh, what was that? Oh, oh no. That's a boom boom. We're gonna take care of that. Finally, I had the stables within my reach. And nothing's gonna go wrong. That's when I met Sheriff Pat Garrett. I read that you went toe to toe with him, sir. That backstabbing bastard with that tacked on tin star. Oh, yes. Handsome. challenged him to a showdown. You read that in a dime novel? It said he showed no fear as he took your measure with eyes like a rattlesnake. Keep your enemy in focus. Losing right. Oh, okay. Okay. Where are you going? Where are you going? When your opponent reaches for their gun, press right trigger. Draw your weapon, aim with RS, and then shoot. So I gotta hit it twice. And that you killed her <laughs> in a fair fight. <laughs> Is that what that Penny Dreadful said? No, boy. That ain't what I meant when I said I met Pat Garrett. I mean, I met him. We went so out for beer. Start again. I finally reached those damn stables. And nothing can go wrong. Damn, now I'm hungry. Steak is lush. Yeah, steak is life. Steak is the best food. And stepped inside. And... <gasps> Last thing I heard was Garrett's voice. That's not Billy. And go on. How did it end? End? Boy, that was just the beginning. 
47% accuracy was better than I thought. Alright, so saves and nuggets of truth I found previously. <laughs> Dual Pat Garrett, 87, 59. Okay. Okay. I'll take it. 